This is CMN. This is Canadian MGTOW. Having fun, and not giving a shit. My first story today is about Ariana Grande. No, not a fancy coffee at Starbucks, but the pop singer. Recently she was in a car with her boyfriend when a fan of her boyfriend ran up to his window to tell him how big a fan he was. The fan then added, Ariana is sexy as hell man, I see you, I see you hitting that. So what would a self-confident woman do in that situation? Why she would go on to Twitter and exclaim how she was treated like a piece of meat. Followed by the usual feminist tirades of just because I dress like a whore doesn't mean I should be treated like one, blah, blah, blah. After playing the victim card flawlessly, what was a little bit surprising was her last two sentences. We are not objects or prizes. We are queens. My what a self-entitled gynocentric comment. What we have here is not outrage of being treated like a piece of meat, but in truth the failure to venerate women. The articles that covered this story never once mentioned her boyfriend's reaction or actions, so maybe she is really upset about him not getting violent towards the fan by proxy. Regardless, I cannot take Ariana seriously when she refers to her music as art. Speaking of so-called art, Lena Dunham dressed up as a mermaid and published this photo of herself washed up on a beach. Looks more like a beached land whale. After all, art is in the eye of the beholder. At any rate the feminists in the first two stories can calm their tits knowing that 2016 was a banner year for feminism there were four big firsts that they can be so proud of. First woman under FBI investigation to lose a presidential election. First female DNC chairman to resign for tampering with a primary. The first ever first lady to claim she has lost hope in her country. And, the first woman to get fired from CNN for leaking debate questions. Bravo. Bravo. I think my picture will also be SJW approved as half our people of color, and there is probably a transsexual in the mix to boot. I'm Canadian MGTOW, more news and my goddamn opinion later on this CMN station.